Hey, what's up, bros? Hope you're doing good. Welcome to episode 2 of the Leicester City career mode with Frank Lampard as a manager. And in today's episode, um, we are going to be finishing the transfer window, making some signings. So we're going to be finishing the month of August. We're going to be playing Wolves, West Ham. We're going to sim Norwich, and, yeah. So, yeah, it'll be a good episode. We still need to sign a right winger, or, yeah, a winger. Because we need one for backup, or to be starting at least. But, yeah. We have, like, 38 million, but I think we have more. Cause I don't think we need a 700 on wage budget, so yeah, we, we have a lot of money, so that's actually very good. But yeah, but um, we won the community shield against Man City last episode, so that was good to start off the curve mode with. But yeah, um, so my options for for the Winger side, either left mid or right mid, is either Nicolas Pepe or Jack Harrison. But I feel Jack Harrison can be good for the Leicester City side, but I think Nicolas Pepe can be better. So, yeah, he's 26, 80 overall. But, I mean, that's good. I mean, I think we can grow a lot of him. He has a finesse shot, trait, spit dri dribbler, technical dribbler, flair, long shot taker. So, yeah. So, let's go ahead and go for Nicolas Pepe. Let's go ahead and negotiate with Arsenal. And, yeah. Let's hope we can get him for your cheap. Let's offer with... Let's give him 26 million and oh they want 38 no that's not gonna work 27.9 I guess 38 they're sticking to 38 which I don't like that all right let's go with 30 Point nine. Thirty-eight. No, 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 no. All right. Thirty-five point five. Okay, they just said that. I don't know. We're paying too much for him, but yeah. All right. So we're here negotiating his contract terms. Squad rule important. Four years. No release clause. And wage eighty thousand. Um, for his wage and signing bonus of 720. And yeah, let's see what he accepts this. And he does. Nicolas Pepe is Frank Lampard, new signing for Leicester City. So, yeah, Nicolas Pepe joins Leicester City. Um, and yeah, so these are the two signings we have made, and probably the only ones we make this season at least. Navi Keita and. Nicolas Pepe, both 26 years old, so they can give us like five good seasons. It's actually good, though. That's actually good. So, yeah, very happy with these signings. Okay, bro, so this is how the starting 11 would look like with the 4 3 3. Casper, Schmeichel, and Goal. Castagna has a right back because remember, um, Pereira is injured. So, yeah. And then for the right center back, Fonfana. Sonyunku, well, he's going to be playing on the left side, but he's a right footed. And Justin, and Didi, Tillmans, and Madison in the midfield. What a great trio to have there. Then on the wings, Barnes, and Pepe, and then Jamie Vardy. So this is actually a good team. Wow, what a team. What a team. Very proud with it. Very happy with this team. All right, bros. Frank Lampard first game of the Premier League with Leicester City against Wolves. He already has experience in the Premier League. 
but now it's with, he had it with Chelsea, but now it's his turn to have it with Leicester City and see how it goes. Let's see how this project goes with him. And yeah, so Wolves, uh, tough side to play, especially since they play with five in the back. But yeah, they got a good team. But yeah, let's go ahead and play Wolves. Let's we can get the three points. Let's go. Hello everyone, welcome to the King Power Stadium where the weather is absolute. It's Leicester City versus Wolverhampton Wanderers. Well, the atmosphere is incredible inside the stadium, Derek. There's a real sense of optimism amongst the fans about the new season and what it might bring. It's been a long wait, but hopefully we get a great game to kick their campaigns off. Well, that'll be a free kick. Making sure nothing untoward happened. It might be on for them. Nelson Tomato has it. Giving them a different option by moving in field. Oh, really sound goalkeeping. Well, that's such a good save, isn't it? How did he keep that one out? And over comes the corner. Not the best clearance. Well, that's the end of that for now. On here, options available. Can they keep it going? In it goes! He scored on his debut, and his fans are loving that. Well, let's look at this again, Derek, because the transition when the ball changes hands is so quick. And when he gets onto it, he holds off the challenge, keeps his balance, and makes good contact with the ball. That's a top-class finish. 1-0, then. The first half. So, back in business. Leicester with the lead, but this game far from being done and dusted. An update to bring you from Vicarage Road. There's been a goal there, Alex. It's a goal for Watford. It's now 1-0 with 46 minutes played. Alex keeping us right up to date. A lot of quality to his new club, and you'd expect him to have an impact straight. Oh, hang on, Stuart. Big chance here. Oh, a tremendous block. And a goal. The equaliser. Superb entertainment. Well, let's have another look at this, because he does really well to pick the right pass here. And it ends up with a fairly simple finish. Certainly not much the goalkeeper can do about that. So the ball is rolling again at one all. Number nine, Raul Jimenez. Now indeedy. Was close, but he's put it over. Well, just to point you in the stoppage time situation, two minutes the word. What a shocking pass, really. So the final whistle and the Alright bros, so we got our second Premier League game against West Ham. They're in ninth place. They probably won their first game in the league. But yeah, they're gonna be a tough side to play against. They have a good team, good squad, and good manager too. But yeah, um let's see how we can do this. And yeah, let's hope we can win this game. Let's go. Hello to you. Many different varieties of rain gear on show here at the London State against Leicester City. Well, Derek, as is always the case, the team that dominates midfield will be the team that controls the flow of the game. And that, for me, is the area that's key today. Antonio. Determined defending. 
And the starting lineup for West Ham United. The experienced Lukasz Fabianski stands between the posts. Angelo Ogbonna plays alongside Kurt Zuma in central defence. And they line up for Niles. Can't argue with that little move. Now well, let's see about the cross. Can they forge ahead? They do! And you've got to say, they're good value for the lead. So the action underway again. And certainly the onus is on Leicester to come up with a reply here. Castagna. Here's Tielemans. Ndidi. Chris. And I think the threat has been averted. Vardy. Takes aim. A goal! type of game now they're level well let's look at this again Derek because the transition when the ball changes hands is so quick and it's a great finish he holds off the defender keeps his composure and finds the back of the net it's a marvellous goal so underway again following the goal that made things level Can he find the net? And a goal! Another one! Two in quick succession! No wonder they're celebrating! Well, here it is again, and it's all about the pace on the counter-attack. They were so quick to break out from their defensive positions, and then what a strike. That's hit with such ferocity. Certainly no stopping that. That's a great goal. Well, as they kick off again, 2-1 the current state of affairs. And one minute of stoppage time has been added on. Madison. So into the second half then Leicester with the advantage but certainly no room for complacency Nicola Pepe Castagna Madison with it Tielemans. Oh, he's given us away inexplicably. Pepe. And there it is, a penalty given and a chance perhaps for them to finish this off. Well, some might say he's been fortunate to avoid being shown the card. Well, I like that from the referee. Just because it's a penalty doesn't mean it's a yellow card. I think he's got it right. And this could finish it off. Oh, he's guessed correctly and saved it! If they can score again from this corner, it probably would be the end of the story. Not the result from the set piece they were looking for. And the referee blows for full time. So we get a 1 3 win against Norwich. Daka scores scored two goals, and Keita, Nabi Keita scored one goal. So yeah, I rotated the side kind of. I put um, Baka, um, Luckman, Keita, Samari, and yeah, so great result. So the Transfer window has been closed. They will spend 480 million. I think I think that's the number. Uh, sorry, I feel dumb when I don't know my numbers. But yeah. Um. 
yeah, but I'm gonna leave the episode here. I hope you guys enjoy. It, it was a good episode. Um, we start off the league strong. We're in third place, seven points. But yeah, next episode we'll be playing in the Europa League. And yeah, we have big games like against Manchester City. But yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this episode. If you guys did, make sure make sure to drop a like. I will appreciate it. And make sure to subscribe. And yeah, I'll see you guys next video. Peace.